हेलो एवरीवन दिस इज प्रीतम शाह एंड वेलकम टू माय यूट्यूब चैनल कॉग्नेटिव कोडर्स तो टुडे विल स्टार्ट वन न्यू प्लेलिस्ट ओके तो दिस प्लेलिस्ट विल कंटेन ओनली द सिनेरियो बेस्ड इंटरव्यू क्वेश्चंस ओके वन बाय वन आई विल अपलोड द वीडियोस ओके एंड द वीडियोस विल बी ऑन बेसिकली इट विल इट विल फोकस ऑन दिस सिनेरियो बेस्ड क्वेश्चन व्हिच इज आस्क्ड इन in the uh, mnc companies okay uh, this kind of uh, scenario based question is very much useful okay whenever you uh, you are preparing for any uh, mnc companies or any kind of product based companies data engineering question okay the spark scenario question okay so uh, before before going to the video uh, i would uh, like to request you guys please subscribe our channel and uh, share our videos i can see um, uh, lots of people daily uh, coming to our channel uh, seeing our videos but not subscribing us or not sharing our videos not um, giving any kind of comment okay please 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 do like share and subscribe otherwise we can't grow without your support we can't grow i am telling you guys lots of time okay please 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 support us so that uh, daily basis we can upload the videos uh, and uh, we can reach to the large or broad audience okay as uh, what i can say okay so please support us and going back to my <coughs> notebook so today's scenario is uh, the, so we have one da da data set okay we have one data set we can we can say it say youtube uh, uh, click through it scenario okay let's say we can consider it not uh, like this okay just uh, you can consider it as like that youtube click through it yeah, as we all know whoever we, we all know the youtube video click through it and all how it is calculated but still if you don't know I, i'll go to the scenario one second so write and first part code to find the ctr ctr means click through rate of each ad okay so yeah, uh, each and every uh, video uh, yeah, the continuation hours bahut sara ad aata hai lots of ad it is coming suddenly so that ads uh, if it is useful then we click the ad and we uh, see the videos or if it is not useful then we uh simply we skip the ad or okay ignore the ad so uh, based on that this question is there okay based on that youtube uh, or google is doing some calculations okay the, that is called the click through rate or how many users are clicking the video uh, video how many users are watching how many users are uh, ignoring the video okay based on that youtube uh, calculating the click click through rate okay so uh, the same way youtube is, has given some ad ids some user ids some action uh, action by the user id so user 1 uh, clicked perform the click operation for the ad id ad id 1 okay user 2 perform the click operation for ad id 2 user 3 perform the view operation for ad id 3 user 5 ignored for ad id 5 okay user 7 ignored for ad id 1 okay user 7 view also perform the view operation for ad id 2 okay well, 5 also perform click operation c and in this way 4 can view operate for perform view operation for 1 2 perform click operation for 1 okay so uh, what they want they want uh, uh, we need to write one code to find the click through rate and uh, of each ad and we need to round off the click through rate click through rate to two decimal point okay after decimal uh, uh, there will be two uh, integer okay so uh, that we can do the using the round round off function okay if you don't know the round off function you can go to my pyspark database playlist okay which is, uh, the link has been given to the video description you can go through that you will get, get to understand how to how to use the round of function okay okay then order or after that what they required they want order the result uh, table 
what are the result will by click through it in descending order and if the in case the your ctr is uh, tight for uh, any two users uh, that in that case uh, you need to uh, get the result by add id in ascending order okay so we'll see um, how to do it okay so basically click how to get the click through rate click through rate equals to click divided by click plus view okay so this is the formula okay so first uh, i have imported uh, all the necessary functions and all types and uh, here we will use the window function so i have imported the window okay so i if you don't know the window function you can go through my uh, window function video where i have um, i have discussed all the things about the window function how to utilize why it is required all those is cool things uh, in the um, uh, in my PySpark database um, playlist uh, the link has been given to the video description you can go through it so here that they have defined the schema explicitly you can go uh, you can understand using the struct type and struct field okay and this also i have explained in my PySpark database playlist you can go through it uh, yeah, you will get to understand how to define the um, uh, schema explicitly okay so uh, i will also provide you um, the video link in the i button okay you can click on that directly and see it. and after that you can come to this video okay these, these are the prerequisite video i can say okay so coming back um, so here um, i have written all the code okay for saving the time okay i have already solved um, this um, uh, question okay so i will go through yeah one by one okay and try to understand so here first what what we are doing first we are trying to get the click through it okay ctr click through it uh, data frame so first what we are doing here we have user ids which uh, uh, each each and every user id have performed multiple actions for multiple ads so what they want they want they what they want they want the click through rate for each ad okay click through rate for each ad they want so for each ad they want so that's why we need to do it perform the group by on the add function add id function okay so for each and every ad so uh, here multiple ads are there for multiple users okay so we need to segregate the ads for so uh, uh, we are performing the group by function on add id okay after that we will uh, um, we'll perform the aggregation some aggregation and when statement okay so what we are doing so each uh, when we are performing the uh, add id so based on each add id when the action when the action is clicked what they are asking they they they, they are taking one as a value okay if it is not a not a click then it is taking zero as a value so for suppose for add id one as example add id one it uh, it is a click a click action so it, it will consider as one so for add I, here also add i add id one uh, add id add id one here it is clicked option so here once again it is uh, considered one okay so sum of one plus one two so for add id one it has considered two as a click count okay here they are they are get, uh, taking one new column as a click count so for each and every add id how much click count is there they are getting from this okay and once again for view count also we we can get the view count from here okay and after that what we are doing after that we have this function click by click plus view so after that we can get the click through rate so here it is the click through rate i am running it okay so here it is the click through rate what it is doing uh, first it is uh, using with column it is taking one, one new column and after that uh, 
click count by uh, click count plus view count okay and uh, uh, they want us to get the uh, get the value up to two to two decimal sorry so that's why we are using the round of function okay after that uh, we are uh, getting the click through rate as like data okay so for each and every ad we are getting the click count we are getting the view count and after that using the ctr formula we are getting the ctr okay so for ad file there are no view no click count no view only it is ignored only uh, for ad file only it is ignored that's why it is null okay so we are getting the click through rate now our main task is completed we are getting the uh, click through rate based on the round of two decimal now what we need to do now it's our presentation part okay how we will show the data to our end user okay so how we will show the data uh, they want us to show the data by uh, descending order the ctr uh, by ctr in descending order okay and if it is tie the ctr is tie for any of the ad then we need to consider the ad id as ascending order so that thing we need to implement in our code so for implementing that we will use the window function here so uh, we will we will create one window ordered by first uh, ctr will be in descending order and add id will be ascending a first it, it will consider the ctr in descending order if the ctr is tied then it will consider the add id as ascending order okay based on that it will create one window so after that in 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 result here what we are doing we are creating one column which is called the rank and we will get the rank based on this window okay so first it will consider the ctr and if ctr is tied then it will consider the add based on that it will get one rank okay it will give us one rank okay so you can see if it is tied then it will uh, then it will consider directly the add id okay our add id is c ascending order so the rank is c okay so now now what they want now we can directly from from here get the add id and see here you can see the result here if i am going to yeah the result here is add id 1 0.6 2, 3 is it's a type that's why 2 is first and 3 is after that and 5 is null okay so this is the panda this is the um, solution of this scenario question okay i think you have understood the concept okay if you have any kind of doubt you can connect with me via linkedin uh, via my instagram profile or via topmate okay any of any of the profile you can connect with me i will try to help you guys or you can comment on the video comment section uh, so that i can um, directly connect to you, you guys and i can help you i can guide you uh, if you have any kind of doubt i will try to clarify your doubt okay and if you have any other approach you that also you can uh, comment on the video comment section okay so so that i also can learn uh, from you guys okay so thank you for watching this video and please 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 do like share and subscribe our youtube channel okay and i have uploaded lots of interview question videos you can go through it uh, the real time scenarios you can go through it and also the main important thing is pipe for database playlist there are lots of video uploaded okay after 60 plus video i have uploaded on pipe video database uh, functions and all okay which which are the main pillar for uh, learning the pipe of right? okay so please go through that if you are aspiring uh, for a data engineering role i can say okay this will be very much helpful for you guys okay 
तो थैंक यू फॉर वाचिंग आवर वीडियो प्लीज डू लाइक शेयर एंड सब्सक्राइब आवर यूट्यूब चैनल एंड प्लीज सपोर्ट अस सो दैट वी कैन रीच टू दिस ब्रॉडर ऑडियंस ओके सो दैट एवरीबॉडी कैन गेट द यूजफुल थिंग्स फ्रॉम आवर चैनल ओके गेट द बेनिफिट्स ऑफ दिस वीडियो ओके सो थैंक यू